Hi, I'm Ian Harrison for AmericanRifleman.org and I'm here at the annual conventions here with Season 2 of Top Shot winner Chris Reed. Chris, how are you doing, mate? Congratulations. Thank you, Ian. Thank you. I'm doing good, man. Good, good. I know some of the viewers may be not, not totally familiar with your background, so why don't you give us a quick rundown as to who you are, where you're from? Um, of course, my name's Chris Reed, and I'm 37 years old from Greenwood, Mississippi, originally, and uh, just a hunter, fisherman, outdoorsman, and love to shoot. Great, great. Now, obviously, you have a really diverse background uh, in the shooting sports. Um, how do you think that helped you win Top Shot in Season 2? I think winning Top Shot Season 2, you're going to have to be diverse. Uh, they throw so many weapons at you, you know, with the archery and shotgun and rifle and stuff, so my background, uh, I think, played well to it. Cool. What do you think? The two winners of Top Shot se uh, Season 1 and Season 2 so far, both the only two guys with subtitles. What's up with that? <laughs> Nobody can understand either one of us. <laughs> <laughs> so um, tell me what your plans for your winnings. Uh, my plan for my winnings is just to, to basically invest in my children's education. And uh, I've got a 10 year old and 8 year old and be looking out for a college education fund. Outstanding, outstanding. So have you been uh, staying in touch with any of the guys from season two? I do stay in touch with quite a few of them uh -huh. uh, on a regular basis. That's good to hear. Yeah, I can find that in season one as well as a, a strange bond that develops amongst everybody who's been locked down in that house for, for six weeks. Yeah. And uh, yeah, I think it's going to continue for a long time. So um, what do you think is going to happen in season three? Season three is, is going to have their work cut out for them if they try to outdo season two. Yeah, so. I think so. I think so. Yeah, we, we're already seeing that uh, there's been a lot more money spent on it. There's a lot more viewers uh, watching the show now. Right. And uh, I think, uh, you know, getting it bigger and better, I think, it, you know, it's going to last for a long time. I, I really think Top Shot just struck a nerve with the community and, and got a lot of people involved in shooting that probably otherwise wouldn't have. And, and I think it's a great show. Yeah, man, to that, man. Thanks for coming to the NRA meetings. You know, you've been a great guest.